fantastic moths. May the wicked flee from it like beasts from a burning wood. Interesting. Find anything? Just his office key in his pockets. Here. Nothing under his belt. Wait. Something sewn in the lining. What is it? The key to a vault. Here. Give it to Dijkstra with my regards. Okay. Key to a vault? No address? Why do I doubt this will make Dijkstra smile? Well, might keep him from setting his thugs on us. Breaking our legs for failing to fulfill our part of the bargain. Meaning glass is half full? Of something strong, I hope. <coughs> I found a letter to Menga from someone important. A spy, I think. A spy? Take a look. Drop boxes, secret signals. Yeah, strong stench of spycraft here. This agent could know more about Dandelion. Bet he does. Letter explains how to signal for a meeting. No mention of where it would take place. Maybe Dijkstra can help. He knows everything. Everything? Slight exaggeration there. I'm not so sure. Hmm. All right. Nothing left for us here. Let's go. Apart from the loot. Be glad to. Just not by way of the main gate. She teleporting out. Not till I've looted this place. This is, I think, imperative now. What we've got in there? Saltpeter. Yeah, I've got to make use of uh, my looting ability while I've still got is that open. No. Oh. I might just attempt to take a cap potion as well, but it's many of the bodies actually. I'll go and loot the bodies. Yes, exactly. That's what I'm looking for. More of those shackles, please. There might be some more downstairs as well. Mariborian style silver ingot. Okay. Good job I didn't leave that. Nothing like looting on a timer. The pressure's on. Don't, don't, don't click those, Mark. Don't click those. So I kind of, well, I won't say I blew that. I'm quite happy with the outcome. Butter knife. I'm sure I needed that. But it's definitely going to be a different story going forwards now. To what you guys have probably experienced. Okay. I think everyone's dead. That's Triss again. So, oh, let's just do it. Let's just do it for fun. Because we can blow it up. So, where am I supposed to find a way out of this place? Through here? Is this... Okay, we'll go this way. This is where we split up. But first... Let's burn this shack down. Agreed. We've left too much evidence. Yeah, but I also need to blow off some steam. Listen, there's one other thing I wanted to talk about. But not here, and definitely not now. Come by later when you have a moment? I'd appreciate it. All right. We need to get out of here. Well, even if I haven't, um, you know, blown this pl well, I haven't done the quest as may be intended. Um, I'm sure I've gone up in Triss's estimation. Can I set stuff on fire? I want to play this game too. Can I set that on fire? That's just lootable. We and die. That should do it. I'm going. You should too. Mm -hmm. Okay. Not about to use the teleport though. See you, Triss. Are we going out over the walls then? 
We out. We're out. Right. Right. Um... Was that a mistake? I now jumped into a location I can't get out of. That looks like it's audible. It is indeed. You there, Mr. Roven wants a word. Who the hell is this? Bastard. What? Nothing. Be there soon. Who do I spy? Why, it's Geralt of Rivia. <sighs> will you stop following me already? I will, as soon as you tell me where my treasure is. Hmm. Me and Menga didn't see eye to eye. How badly? Badly. <laughs> I suppose that explains the smoke. <laughs> my treasure's not in there, is it? Burning with the witch hunters. Didn't see it anywhere. And 20 tons of gold is hard to miss. You mean to say you've come to me empty-handed? First off, you came to me. Second, I do have something in my hand. The key to a vault, founded on Menga. A vault? That I need to find on my own? You've not made things much easier for me. Give me that. I'll give you this invisible key. Just be careful you don't drop it. That's all you're gonna say? No wry remark, no scintillating joke. <laughs> you want a knee slapper? Fine, I'll tell you one. Ready? You lied to me. Again. What? You knew from the start who robbed me, but you didn't deign to share that information with me. How do you find out? I asked the questions here. Not true. That was a statement. Come on, Dijkstra. <laughs> this tough guy act doesn't work on me. Mm. We're both adults. Act like one. <laughs> ah, Geralt. I should have you strangled, but I like you, you bastard. Um. We're going with the tough guy act. That makes one of us. I know, I know. Oh, the sleep I lose because of that. <laughs> now that we've professed our feelings for each other, <laughs> how'd you figure it out? Since from the start you were up to something. You didn't haggle about your pay. And then I heard from my sources that Margrave Henkel and Dandelion had rubbed elbows. Wasn't hard to connect the dots. And now, time to settle things. That a threat? Quite the contrary. You helped me, Witcher. So in spite of everything, you've earned your reward. I take it you've still no idea what happened to Dandelion? None. Found someone who might know, though. A spy, I guess. Signs his name, Yammerlack. Found a letter of his. Just one problem. It only details how to arrange a meeting with him. Makes no mention of where. A ruined house in far corners. Give the signal, and he'll show up there the same day, just before midnight. Probably shouldn't ask, but... Dijkstra, how the hell do you know all this? I draw it all from the flight patterns of birds. Your sarcasm. It gets tiring, you know? I have far worse qualities than that, believe me. And a final humble plea. Don't try to fool me again. Ever. Can't promise to that. I do like the banter these two have. It's really good. Oi! I, I thought he was going to try and push me in the water. <laughs> that would be a nice little finishing touch. Okay, so find the drop box using your Witcher senses. Place the holy tome there. Uh, we've got whatever else we've got. The Fists of Fury one, which I don't think I'm quite ready for. Swords and dumplings. Is that the next one? Count Royven's treasure. It carries on. That's us, isn't it? Right, let's go do it. Oh, hang on. Let's go find the flipping merchant first and sell off some of this rubbish. Okay, time for you to leave, Daisy. Cheers for stopping by. Hope you have a, a nice rest of your day, whatever you get up to. Um, I should be streaming this again Friday night. Unless I've got uh, a key for Outward, in which case I'll be streaming that instead. But um, we shall see.
But uh, yeah, have a nice time. Shopkeeper. Where's the fish market at from here? I need to turn around and run the other way. I need to go find a blacksmith and an armorer would be great. Mind you, that decoction lasts for ages yet, so I'm, I'm all right for a bit. I think. Oh, hang on. Here we go. Here we go. We've got a poor townsman. He's on the other side of that, isn't he? I do get tired of being spat at every time I run through places. Right then, you sir. What do you have on offer? Redanian dumplings, speciality of the house, heartily recommended. Blimey, a vat gun in my establishment, it can't be. How do you know I'm a witcher? You joking? Silver blades, who else uses them? Crafted in Mahakam, am I right? Must be about 40 inches long. An elven sword expert. You must be Ibir Hattori. Ah, indeed. I am. Geralt of Rivia. Heard a lot of good things about you. A pleasure, Geralt. How might I help you? Care to try a dumpling? Well, yes, I, I'll take a dumpling, but this might be a stroke of luck. This is exactly the kind of guy I was looking for. Mmm. Tasty. Mm, glad to hear it. Anything else I can do for you? Yes, come on then. We've got to um, get some swords made. Looking for a good swordsmith. No one. <laughs> Three swords on your back. A bit much, don't you think? Good one. But all jests aside, you make swords anymore? Really? It's dumplings now. I must make a living, but I miss the hammer, anvil, and bellows. Oh, the heat of the forge, were it not for that swiving Van Horn. I don't know what you're talking about. Uh, I shan't greet a witcher with dumplings. Come, let me show you something. We're on to something here, chat. Quite a collection. Premium quality, too. Thank you. I've kept these as mementos. That doesn't look so premium. Battered round shield. Damn shame you don't make them anymore. I'd gladly replace what I have with this kind of steel. Someone with your skills? Why the hell are you needing dough? This might surprise you. The pay is better. Really? But above all, it's much safer. Food vendors rarely disappear or end up as cripples. I see. Someone controlling Novigrad's smithing market? Not officially, though all supplies go through Ernst Van Horn. And they say he plays cards with Cleaver ah. frequently. We can deal with Cleaver? Ernst Van Horn. Who's that? Modest beginnings. A small dockside workshop. However, he proved extremely ambitious. He knew he could not compete with other sword makers on skill alone, so he resorted to other methods. Other methods? A bit of slander here, buying business debt cheaply and taking over there. And whenever the competition was a plowing non-human, he'd accuse them of being Havocars. Is that how he did you in? I did not give up without a fight. I went to Town Hall, negotiated. Alas, it was all in vain. He'd already enlisted Cleaver's protection. And in Novigrad, few dare get in Cleaver's way. Till I arrived. Tried negotiating? Making a deal? With Van Horn? Do you jest? He's a proper heartless bastard. Either play by his rules and pay him, or go out of business. Hmm, I see. But I shan't complain. Dumplings have proven an excellent source of income... It's just, well... Not as exciting. You miss the heat of the forge. Tried getting supplies from someone else? Those rogues of the underworld control all the sources. How am I to talk to them? Unless... Would you be willing to help me? 
Sure. Want me to help you get your supplies? How? Just come with me to a meeting. As my bodyguard, it'll bolster my confidence. Truth be told, not so long ago, I tried negotiating some iron deliveries with one of the King of Beggars' men. Right. King wouldn't worry about an embargo Cleaver imposed. It's just... He demanded an inordinately large share of the profits. I thought you might help me negotiate. I don't mean gratis. I'm certain we can agree on a fee. Could I... choose something from your collection? Hmm. Oh, forget this rubbish. I shall forge you a sword fit for killing gods. I don't know. Criminal underworld. Not really sure I want to meddle with that. Oh, we do. I badly need your help. Van Horn is a Van Horsen. He must be taught a lesson. I'd be eternally grateful. Plate armor, yours. Or perhaps you'd like a catapult or a, a trebuchet. Yes, yes, I would. Very much. I'll take Fine. those. Arrange the meeting. Splendid. Meet me after dark. Near the crane at the docks. Excellent. Oh, I don't care about messing with the criminal underworld. We've upset... We've upset enough things around here, so... Um, wrong time of day, unfortunately, for this, but... Cool. That, unfortunately, doesn't help me with my immediate problem of having to get rid of about 50 or 60 pounds worth in weight of crap. I was looking for the fish market. Where the hell is the fish market? Is it on the other side of this? There's, there's something on the other side. I know there's another armor and swordsmith that I have been to. Can I go through this bit here? There is a way through somewhere. There'll be a hole between some houses somewhere. I'm gonna find damn vendor. I am. Maybe it wasn't down here. Where the hell was it when I went and found? That was just a street full of bandits, wasn't it? I remember those. Herbalist over there. What the hell's going on here? Eternal fire, keep me safe. Oh. Push your old woman around. We're back on the riverside, right? Raining oh. again. Hmm. I can't remember where the hell it was. Any suggestions, chat? I put the map on. Hyrax where maybe it's in maybe it's not the fish market I'm looking maybe it's this place I need to be in let's put a marker over there who's that that's Count Royven's treasure well I guess we can go that way on the way I've got enough time before this decoction wears off hey Ragnus how are you that's the dwarf I mean, there there are some Merchants, I'm looking for the blacksmith. Was coming. Felt it. Let's have a quick look in here first. There was something to do with this, oh. I'm sure. Oh, you don't mean to. Oh, oh you the don't mean to. Is the Must front be the drop there box. it is. There it is. Leave that. Deliver us from here. Deliver us from here. Gave the signal. Spies should show up in far corners before midnight. Cool. Deliver us from you heard they're going to allow memes in Article 13, some other stuff for like news and startup business, and maybe they let go of games and YouTube too. Who knows? Um, all of, I think the real details and how Article 13 is going to work has yet to be thrashed out. So I know a lot of people like up in arms about it, and it has the potential to be like bad for YouTubers and Twitchers uh, without without a shadow of a doubt. But um, I'm not going to get too excited or disappointed by it all until I know how it's going to work and how YouTube and Twitch have responded and what they're going to implement. Um, obviously, we want to keep 
keep them aware that we're worried about this, but um, there's no point in sort of declaring the end of the internet just yet, as some people are. An armourer. Excellent. Just the guy. Let's um, go to that in a minute. We've got some crap to sell for us. A lot. He's got some money. Excellent. Let's lighten the load that we've got here. A witch, witch hunter sword we can sell. Oh, should I have been looking at that stuff? Yeah, sell it. Assassin's trousers. One more level and I can wear them. Great, get rid of those. Now let's get rid of some big swords. Yep. Some nice swords as well, but they're going to go. Hey, he's run out of money. Actually, I bet. I be, yeah, yeah, here we go. This is what's weighing me down, look. <laughs> right, he's skinned. Um, let's go to breaking down. I've got some of those handcuffs I need to break down. You can't even imagine the move on Twitch and, you and YouTube's end. I think we just need to wait and see. Just wait and see uh, what they're going to do. Hey, Green Tea, which game do I enjoy more? Kingdom Come or Witcher 3? That's a that's a tough question. Um, it is really tough because the stories in both are really good. Uh, I think in some respects, I prefer the world of Kingdom Come Deliverance because... I mean, you can steal stuff and there's huge consequences. In this, there's a lot less consequences. You can walk into peasants' hovels and just take the pots and pans and stuff. And most of the time, they don't bat an eyelid. So I, I don't do that because it feels a bit weird. But I love the dialogue and the writing and the interaction between characters in this. It is fantastic. Um, I, I couldn't pick one that was the best game. I, I couldn't. I love them both. And... Um, I think they, are, they were over the weekend both on sale on GOG.com. 50% off, I think, both. So if anyone wants one, uh, go and get it because they are amazing things. Yeah, that's what I was going to break down. That. So let's... Um, do we just do that? Yep. Break it down. I've got a ton of silver I can break down. I'm going to give this guy some cash back by dismantling all my silver and gold and stuff. What's that? Timber. I don't think I need to worry about that, do I? A Rose of Remembrance. I think I can get rid of these now, but even so. Don't trust it. Uh, so now he's got a bit of cash, I can go and sell him some more stuff. Might be a good idea. I've got some proper garbage. I could break this stuff down, but I mean, it's not special or anything, is it? What does that dismantle to? Oh, it tells me on the right. Okay, I didn't look at that. Right, he's got some cash. Let's go back to... Let's repair. Repair all. And now go back to selling. You don't expect much from YouTube? They're going to have to do something about that because it does potentially affect a huge chunk of audience. I imagine if, like, uh, imagine if all the countries in the EU couldn't watch certain videos on YouTube or it was restricted viewing. Imagine what that would do to advertisers, businesses from that zone that rely on, I mean, that's where their customers come from. It would kill a big chunk of YouTube's income. So they're going to have to make sure that they are working with Article 13 correctly and it's going to be all right. Um, so it w YouTube will have to make sure that you know, they're, it's, it's, they're going to have to do something to make it work, basically. And I don't know what that is, but I strongly suspect they will make it work so that we can carry on doing stuff like this as normal. That's my suspicion. I might be wrong, but we'll just have to wait and see on that. Because um, I think it's probably too important to just be let go. So we'll, we'll see. Willing to craft something for me? Which game do you prefer, Green Tea? Have you you played them both, or uh, have you you own one of them? 
I can do the enhanced griffin boots, but then I won't have boots for a little time, so we don't really want to do that. The feline boots. We've got the cat gear stuff. I think it's cat gear I want, isn't it? More than griffin gear. Yeah, let's do that. Um, we've got the bits. Craft that. Can I put a filter on this, by the way? I want... No, I can't. I wanted just Witcher gear. I know I haven't got all the cat gear either, so... Like, I haven't got the chest armor. Oh, I have. But there's components missing. I can buy a shirt. Excellent, that works out nice. Right, craft that. This could be a nice little upgrade coming up here. Uh, what else do we want to go into? Into crafting components? No, 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 we're not. You haven't yet, but you're saving up for a good PC and you hope to play both of them. I feel slightly more excited about Kingdom Come, though. I think Kingdom Come Deliverance is a bit more demanding on the graphic side of a PC than this is, based on my own testing of the two. But, um, yeah, the, the I have found myself loving this game more than I expected to when I, when I first started it. Uh, there's a lot of things that have surprised me, but all in all, it's the story writing that's it's just it's just superb in this. It really is. So feline gauntlets, we can do that. Let's make them. Now what else is there? I don't know. There's feline silver sword. Okay. So we can't do the sword stuff yet. So that's a superior one. There should be a. I haven't got the recipe for the regular one by the looks of that. And I can't do the enhance that one. Cool, there's, there's stuff to work on. Steel swords, feline steel sword enhanced. Can't do that. Jumerian, I thought that said Cimmerian steel sword for a moment. I thought we've passed over into Conan's territory. And the trousers. Griffin trousers, feline trousers. All right, this is going to be good. I'm looking forward to putting all this stuff on. Do I have any gloves or anything? Let's go see what we've got. In fact... I can now go back. He's got loads of cash. I can sell him that sword. <laughs> nice. Nice, 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 nice. Uh, that has helped a little bit with our encumbrance, but we're still carrying a lot of stuff. What will that be? Do these weigh anything? They weigh a bit. Hmm. It might be a ton of crafting materials, you know. Anyway, let's go and check out this armor. So long. Right, let's see what we've got. So at the moment, I'm wearing uh, griffin gear. But the feline armor, which looks like a nice improvement, the bonus I get, strong attacks increase fast attack damage for five seconds by 10% for each piece of the set. Rear attacks deal 50% more damage and also stun opponents at the cost of one adrenaline point. I like the idea of that. Let's equip that. Um, so the Griffin armor is giving me better sign intensity and a bit better resistance. Better resistance from monsters, okay. But the feline arms give me better attack power and better resistance to elemental damage. Let's put it all on. This looks a bit, uh, a bit dandyish, maybe. Assassin's trousers, great. I can get rid of them now. And the gauntlets. Oh no, they look nice. I like the look of this set. This looks pretty good. Let me just check this out. What bonuses am I getting? Okay, so you don't get the bo set bonuses until they're up to Grandmaster level. That's okay. So that's nothing to worry about too much at the moment then. I like that. That looks pretty cool. I approve. Right. Back to...